welcome back everyone you may be in a situation where you actually want to go ahead and clear out a ton of storage on your iphone now i'm going to show you some of the most common ways to do this and to be honest it's much easier than a lot of you may think the first thing i would always recommend doing is to just delete any applications that you're currently not using now personally there's a lot of apps on my phone that i never use and i just end up just stockpiling them and i never delete them so if you ever want to delete an app just hold it down like this find ones that you're not using click remove app click delete app, and that app will go ahead and be deleted as long as you click delete and follow through. There's a lot of times where some people will just delete it from you know, their home screen and not actually delete the app. So make sure you're going through and actually deleting the applications for the most part. Now let's say you go and do that. Another thing I would recommend doing is to actually monitor and even see how much storage is being used on your device. So to do this, what we can do is we can make our way over to our settings application. When we're in our settings app, we can scroll down until we get into our general settings. So go and click on general right there. Now what we can do is we can go and click on our iPhone storage, which is right here. Now when we click there, we will get a great tremendous breakdown of what is being used the most on our specific iPhone. So here we can get a great breakdown of, okay, well, photos is being used by, you know, 55.58 gigabytes. And we have, you know, tons of other apps and other things that are being used in our device. Now, system data doesn't take that big of an amount. It's just photos. So what I would do is I'll click on the photos down here and you should be able to see a great breakdown of basically what I can go ahead and delete from my specific you know, phone. You can see it says save 43.70 megabytes, automatically upload and safely store all your photos in iCloud. Now I'm not going to do that because I use my iCloud source for other things, but that is a really easy thing you can do to pretty much go through and delete all your photos, maybe back them up into you know, some other storage facility like iCloud or you know, maybe Google Cloud of some sort, and you can go and free up a lot of storage that way. But there's a lot of games and there's a lot of other stuff here that I don't ever use like Free Fire. I'm not going to I'm not going to play that game ever again. So I'm just going to go ahead and delete this application and that will free up a little bit of storage. I can go ahead and delete PUBG or GarageBand or delete any really any other thing on my iPhone. I don't even know what this is. So pretty much there's just a bunch of stuff within my phone I can delete. And those are some other things you can do as well. But this is like the control panel of your storage. You want to go through here, pretty much delete anything you're not using anymore. And that will pretty much fix it for the most part. So. That pretty much covers it up. If you have any other thoughts or questions, let me know in the comment section below. Hit the like button, that would be so much, but definitely hit that subscribe button. More importantly than everything else, I love every single one of you guys. Hopefully I'll catch you guys in the next video. Peace out till then.